This video shows you how to create a silver frame or border in CorelDRAW. Start by creating a rectangle. Select the polygon tool. Hold down the control key as you drag it out to constrain it. Give it four sides. Move it down to the left side of the rectangle and make the upper right side of the diamond shape large enough to cover the edge of the rectangle. Move it so that the edge lines up with the top left corner of the rectangle. Select the rectangle, then the Mesh Fill tool. Give it nine rows and one column. You can delete the first section on the left. Move the left edge to line up with the edge of the diamond. Make the diamond larger and line up the shapes again. Drag the bottom point down and create an angle that looks something like this. Copy and paste the shape and mirror it horizontally. Repeat the process used on the left side to shape the right side of our first shape to match the right side of the pasted shape. I'm working in simple wireframe view so that I can see the outline of both shapes. Once that's done, the copy can be deleted. The diamond shape can also be deleted. Select the shape with the shape tool. Give it one column and five rows. Select the top two points and make them something like a 90% black. Change the view to Enhanced in order to see the changes. The second row is a 20% black. The third is a 60% black. The fourth is a 90% black. The fifth is a 20% black. and the bottom is a 70% black. Move the shape up. Copy and paste it and rotate it 90 degrees. Move it over to fit against the left side of the first shape. Delete the outline to get a better look. You can add an outline back to it if you want to after the shapes are lined up. Copy and paste the two shapes and rotate them 180 degrees. I wanted to nudge them closer. The arrow keys were nudging too much at a time, so I changed the settings under Tools, Options, Document, Rulers, and changed the numbers from 0 .01 to 0 .001. I got rid of the outline and closed up the spaces between the shapes. And the silver frame is now finished. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. And thanks for watching.